Hello, welcome to the course on Power Electronics with Wide Band Cap Devices. Today I am going to discuss about the importing of Wide Band Cap Devices in LTSpice software. So let's see how we can import any device in LTSpice for the simulation use. Okay, so this is the detailed procedure which um, I am going to show you the actual how it is can be done. So first we need to go to the website of the Ulf Speed because the silicon carbide device which we are selecting that is from the Ulf Speed. So let's go to this particular website the www.ulfspeed.com slash tools and support slash power slash LT spice and plex models. So you can just directly go to the website and after going to the website you can find tools and support right and then you can find power under tools and support and then under power you can actually go to LTSpice and Plex models. This is the place where we are going directly at this moment. So once you go to this LTSpice and Plex models you will be able to see this particular page in the website in the speed website so now in this you can see there are different models are given plex models are given spice models are given since we are using lt spice we are going to consider the spice model so you need to open the spice models it will take some time to go to that particular page so then under when you are downloading the spice model so you can see this kind of zip file will be downloaded so then you go to the zip file to see what are the models given it is taking some time to open the zip file So you can actually go to other websites also to see if the spice models is given with respect to that particular device. Okay. So you can see this is the folder which is downloaded. Now you can open this particular folder. So under this folder different spice models are given. So you go inside this folder you can see these are the different folders you will be able to see. Under this you can either select modules, discrete components, diodes, bare die, any type of component which you can 